What's going on everybody? In this one, I am rolling with Jason. So you see he drops immediately and he tries to use this two feet to spread me out. Almost caused me to do the splits. He gets guard. I am trying to posture up. And one of the things I do, you can see I'm putting my elbows outside of that, the stomach. That's to keep me squared up with him. Uh, he moves his legs, tries to get them. Oh, like, oh, one leg is out on the outside. I'm trying to flip it over my ear. I'm cognizant of the fact that my, my legs can get caught up on that earpiece. So I'm lifting out a little bit further just because I am wearing headgear. So I'm trying to go around, skirt around to the side. Grab a head and arm. He frames back. Jason is really good at maintaining his frames when you have him in, in half guard. It's hard to nail him down in that sense. Now here, one of the things I'm doing is I'm going for Kamor. And so I'm switching out to the side. I'm keeping, trying to make sure I'm on my toes here. I wanted to put my elbow up against his elbow frame and then I can turn back. My head really is supposed to be over his hip in this position, but I'm trying to turn back and then capture that arm so I can start to press my leg out. One thing you can't see is I have my left arm underneath his left arm and I'm trying to hold his hand with one hand so I can turn around and start working on releasing my leg from that lockdown. Okay, so I'm pushing back. I have my, my arm, I have his arm cinched up so I can work on it. I'm able to get around. And so now I'm in, I'm in side control and I'm still working on this Kimura. So what I'm attempting to do right now is I'm trying to, uh, while holding on to have that, that, that underhook with my left arm, is to thread my right arm through and to go around and grab under his shoulder. You'll see this in a second when he comes around. You see, I have I and I'm folding up to get the tap. So I have it in a regular Kimura position with that left arm, and then I'm taking my arm, threading it through, and going to that shoulder and lifting up for the tap. All right, so we're connected again. I have the inside position. I want to do a snap down, pull his head down, and you'll see I'll snap his head down a little. And I wanted to get it, but he spread out again, and this time he spread me out even further. So now he has this left leg. I'm trying to get it back. And now he's going to do that. That's from the leg lock lab, you know, where you grab it onto that inside of that in between the thigh and the, the, the calf to pull back. But I was able to get my leg back. And here we go again. All right, so I'm trying to clear my, my right leg over his butterfly. can't see how he's holding me here somehow he always oh, has a hold of my, my arms he's doing a good job of keeping me from being able to move at this point and I go over to grab his arm but I missed going for that diving Kimura it's one of the new things I you know I'm continuously working on of course we do it in our warm-ups also I've been working on some different ways of, of entering that from, you can do it from butterfly standing up, etc. Working with the opposite arm. As opposed, when you step in with the right, you usually go to the right, or you step in the left, you go with the left. But sometimes attacking that other arm is unexpected. Now I'm standing up in base. One of the things Storm always tells us when we stand up in base uh, or in someone's guard is, you know, immediately sh uh, shift our hips forward to keep them from sweeping us backwards. So I have my head over his, my arm over his head. I'm turning to the side. Maybe we can see a little bit of what I was talking about here, of where, and I should be off that knee and more on my toes when I turn, you know, in his half guard to work for that Kimura. Okay, let's see here. Jason is working his lockdown. Okay, I'm turning to my side. And my elbow is at his elbow. And you can see I'm trying to work. Uh, he's holding my leg up because I think he he's, uh, understands that my leg is my base that's allowing me to work on that side. That's how he was able to face plant me there. 
you know, um, <laughs> and he's discovered that's my key to balance. And I'm trying to get my elbow to his elbow. My head should be more over his hip in that direction to give me a little bit more leverage to stay on top. I'm trying to take that left arm of mine and use to pull his arm back enough where I can grab his hand. But uh, Jason is, is uh, has long arms and legs, so that's uh, making it a little hard for me here. And so I just decided I'm going to go for that first tap that I was able to get on him. Also, Peter shows that you know showed a variation of that as well. Uh, if some of you guys can watch that, uh, Peter shows the Kimura video. But I would ah, uh, and that's time. All right, guys, thanks for watching. As always, don't forget to like and subscribe. Until next time.